11. I'm Kaylin Hagwood and we begin in Irmo where some new developments are possible. Now last week we told you a portion of Dutch Fork Road near Walmart was rezoned general commercial and tonight we're learning more about what could be on the way. The town of Irmo is growing. A portion of Dutch Fork Road has now been rezoned general commercial, paving the way for new development off the busy street. Barry Walker is the mayor. And I love the fact that you know, people are coming from outside of the area looking at the town of Irmo for expanding their businesses and for relocating here to live. While it's unclear what new business could come to the space, Mayor Walker says developers have expressed interest in putting townhomes or single family homes behind it. One of the things you have to have is if you want people to live here, you have to have housing. And we have a bunch of brand new single family homes that are going up, single family townhomes. The mayor also spoke about traffic, adding that if the new developments move forward, it could lead to more cars on the road. The traffic is what it is. You know, we're getting ready to tear up I-26 and I-20. You talk about traffic. There's going to be a lot of traffic headaches during that construction phase. But what's the good part about it is we're doing things to prepare ourselves for it. We're widening uh, that road, Broad River Road, from I-26 all the way to Ballantyne. Angela Dreer lives in Irmo and says it's a positive move for the town. It shows growth and it actually will allow more families to move into this area. And it's a great area for raising, to raise a family, so I think it's a great idea. Mayor Walker says conversations about what's to come will continue in upcoming town council meetings. Mm -hmm.